subtraction by untying a 10. Children, now you have understood how a 10 can be untied. Now we will solve some sums based on this. Example 1. 22 minus 7 is equal to? Here we have to subtract 7 from 22. There are 2 tens and 2 units in 22. Can we reduce 7 units from 2 units? No, madam. Then what do we have to do now? We will have to untie 1 ten from these 2 tens. Right. How many units will be there after untying 1 ten? And how many tens will be left? There will be 10 plus 2 is equal to 12 units altogether and only 1 ten will be left if we untie 1 ten from 2 tens. Very good. Can we reduce 7 units from these 12 units? Yes, madam. 5 units will remain after reducing 7 units from 12 units. That's right. And only 1 ten is remaining in tens place. We will write it as it is in the answer. So, 22 minus 7 is equal to 15. Example 2. 37 minus 9 is equal to? Here we have to subtract 9 from 37. There are 3 tens and 7 units in 37. We cannot reduce 9 units from 7 units. So what do we have to do? We will have to untie 1 ten from these 3 tens. Correct. If we untie 1 ten, we will get 10 units plus 7 units, that is 17 units. And as we have untied 1 ten out of 3 tens, only 2 tens will be left. Now we will reduce 9 units from 17 units. How many units will remain then? Madam, 8 units will remain after reducing 9 units from 17 units. That's right. Only 2 tens are left in tens place and I will write 2 in the answer. So, 37 minus 9 is equal to 28. Subtraction by untying a 10 in vertical display. Now we will untie a 10 and solve the subtraction sums in vertical columns. 35 minus 17 is equal to? First we will write the sum in tens and units columns. From 35, we will write 5 in units place and 3 in the tens place. The next number is 17. We will write 7 in units place and 1 in tens place. And I will put the minus sign here. Can you tell me should we start from the units place or tens place? Madam, start with the units. Okay. Can we reduce 7 units from 5 units? No, we cannot. So what is to be done now? Madam, untie 1 ten. See? There are altogether three tens. We will borrow one ten in the units place. So only two tens will be left over here. And here we get ten units by untying a ten plus five units, which will together make fifteen units. If we reduce seven units from fifteen units, eight units will be left. And if we reduce one ten from two tens, one ten will be left. So 35 minus 17 is equal to 18. Now you have to tell me how to solve the next sum. 92 minus 53 is equal to? Madam, first write the sum in vertical columns of tens and units. From 92, write 2 in units place and 9 in tens place. Put a minus sign in between. From the next number 53, write 3 in units place and 5 in tens place. We cannot reduce 3 units from 2 units, so we will have to untie a 10. So only 8 tens will remain here and we will have 12 units in units place. Reduce 3 units from 12 units and 9 units will remain here. After reducing 5 tens from 8 tens, 3 tens will be left. So 92 minus 53 is equal to 39. Well done. You have solved it very well. You can practice solving sums at your home in this way.